Hello and welcome to our deep dive into one of the world's most infamous motorcycle clubs, the Hells Angels. Born from the gritty post-war culture of the 1940s, this unique fraternity, with its distinct insignia and defiant spirit, has long held global attention. So rev up your engines and get ready, this ride is going to be anything but ordinary. The Hells Angels, a globally renowned motorcycle club founded in California in 1948, have garnered worldwide interest due to their unique characteristics. They are recognized for their distinct insignia, unyielding spirit, and involvement in several controversial pursuits. They become an influential part of the outlaw motorcycle club subculture, which is rich with exceptional customs, moral codes, and strong loyalty to its fraternity. These groups are distributed across the globe, creating a truly international organization. Originating in the post-World War Ta era, the Hells Angels trace their history back to a group of motorcycle enthusiasts in Fontana, California, known as the Pissed Off Bastards of Bloomington. These pioneers merged their passion for motorcycles with inspirations for military aviation, creating a tightly knit fraternity now universally recognized through its iconic winged death head emblem and its resonant name. We're going to delve into the intricate world of the Hells Angels in this narrative. We'll examine their organizational structure, their societal effects, controversies, and their influences on popular culture. Their club structure is a complex web, delineated by hierarchy and codes that govern their operations. A deeper look into their internal workings provides a sneak peek into this secret of brotherhood. Furthermore, we'll scrutinize the infamous reputation that they've earned due to their involvement in unlawful activities, such as drug trafficking, organized crime, and violent clashes with rival groups. By doing this, we aim to demystify the complex relationships between the Hells Angels and worldwide law enforcement agencies and comprehend the ongoing attempts to impede their illegal activities. Their significant influence on art, literature, and music has left an extraordinary imprint on popular culture, evident in works like Hunter S. Thompson's book, Hells Angels, The Strange and Terrible Saga of the Outlaw Motorcycle Gangs, and their portrayal in various films and documentaries. Over the years, the Hells Angels' journey has been punctuated by several defining moments and events. In 1948, the Hells Angels Motorcycle Corporation was formally incorporated, which was a crucial step in institutionalizing the club's structure and promoting its growth. The 1960s saw extensive media coverage, particularly in 1969 during the infamous Ultimate Free Concert, which shone a light on the darker aspects of their reputation. Another infamous event in their history was the Milpera Massacre of 1984 in Australia, a violent conflict with the Comancheros gang, leading to heightened scrutiny and law enforcement clampdowns. Despite legal hurdles, the Hells Angels have managed to maintain a distinctive subculture and a dedicated following within the motorcycle community. Their iconography, including the iconic winged death head emblem, remains instantly recognizable, contributing to their enduring presence in popular culture. Their hierarchical structure encompasses various ranks, from full patch members to prospects. The executive committee of each chapter, led by a president, vice president, secretary, treasurer, and surgeon at arms, reports to the global leadership, the mother chapter. Each member abides by a strict code of conduct that emphasizes loyalty, fraternity, and respect for club traditions. Symbolism holds a significant place in the Hells Angels ethos. The iconic winged death head emblem of the club represents their identity, and the colors red and white symbolize blood and purity. The 1% patch illustrates their rebellious nature, asserting their nonconformity to societal norms. These symbols act as a visual testament to the Hell's Angels' history and their commitment to their fraternity. The heart of the club is defined by a profound sense of brotherhood and camaraderie. Members develop tight bonds through shared experiences and are expected to protect each other. The club's activities, such as group rides and social events, cultivate camaraderie and establish a support network that members can rely on in challenging times. Motorcycles are central to the Hells Angels' identity, embodying freedom, rebellion, and individuality. The biker lifestyle is vital to the club, reflected in their organized group rides, rallies, and charity events. These events allow members to connect over their shared love for motorcycles, display their riding prowess, and promote the club's image. The Hells Angels uphold unique customs, traditions, and codes of conduct. Respect for hierarchy and loyalty to the club and its members are fundamental principles. The rituals, like the annual Hells Angels Day, strengthen their bonds and reinforce their traditions. 
while their unique language and communication system maintain secrecy and solidarity within the club. The Hells Angels have been entangled in a slew of legal issues over the years due to their participation in criminal activities. Accusations ranging from drug trafficking, organized crime, money laundering, to assault and weapons offenses have led to significant scrutiny from law enforcement agencies worldwide. The Hells Angels Motorcycle Club, a household name, has stirred up controversy due to its ties with societal defiance and regular altercations with rival gangs and law enforcement. High-profile incidents, publicized trials, and negative media attention have amplified these controversies. The club has a reputation for participating in various criminal activities. They've been implicated in drug trafficking, including the distribution of methamphetamine, cocaine, and marijuana. Beyond drug involvement, they've been linked with organized crime networks, participating in activities like extortion, money laundering, and racketeering. Notably, the club has had a fair share of violent incidents, including assaults, bombings, and territorial disputes with rival gangs. However, these events don't define the actions of all club members. It's essential to remember that the Hells Angels is a vast organization, and the activities of a few individuals shouldn't be generalized to represent the entire club. Law enforcement agencies worldwide have made considerable efforts to combat the criminal activities associated with the Hells Angels. Over the years, there have been extensive investigations, multiple arrests, and numerous legal battles, all aiming to dismantle their criminal networks. These measures have led to the disruption of several Hells Angels chapters and the imprisonment of members involved in illicit activities. As a result, the club has had to adjust its operations, choosing a more clandestine approach to their endeavors. Despite these challenges, the Hells Angels have fought back, challenging these law enforcement actions with robust legal defenses. They'd raised issues concerning freedom of association, freedom of speech, and potential violation of individual rights. Their legal battles demonstrate the multifaceted impact of law enforcement actions on the club. Some chapters have disbanded or weakened, but the club as a whole has persisted and adapted to maintain its standing within the motorcycle club community. The media, films, music, and literature have always been fascinated with the Hells Angels, often focusing on their rebellious and outlaw image. They've been depicted in various works, and their portrayal has significantly influenced the club's image and public perception. While some portrayals reinforce their dangerous and lawless reputation, others focus on the sensational aspects of the club's lifestyle and culture, often overlooking the club's positive aspects. Despite the predominant focus on their darker side, the Hells Angels have left a significant imprint on popular culture. Their distinctive insignia, rebellious image, and notorious reputation have become iconic symbols associated with the outlaw motorcycle club subculture. Furthermore, their influence extends to fashion trends, with their distinctive patches and leather jackets becoming recognizable symbols in popular culture. While they are infamous for their criminal activities, it's worth noting that some Hells Angels chapters have been involved in philanthropic efforts and community service. They've organized charity rides, toy drives, and various fundraising events, showcasing their solidarity and support for local communities. The Hells Angels, an emblem of defiance, camaraderie, and rebellion, have left an indelible mark on society. Their story is an enthralling blend of fascination, controversy, and disapproval, reflecting a complex mixture of criminality, brotherhood, freedom, and rebellion. While their notoriety often overshadows other aspects of their identity, their influence on society and popular culture is undeniably significant. That brings us to the end of our journey through the rich, complex, and often controversial world of the Hells Angels. Their story serves as a powerful reminder of the enduring allure of rebellion, brotherhood, and freedom. But it also casts a spotlight on the darker aspects of their legacy. Thank you for joining us on this journey today. If you enjoyed our deep dive, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Until next time.